See pollen going in. Hey y'all, it's me again, Joy. I'm about three days late. I usually like to look seven days later. If I don't put a sale in a nuke box, I like to look seven days later to see if they had made one. Well, I'm at least 10, maybe 12 days later. So I may or not see, may or may not see any evidence of what's going on, but it, at least it'll tell me where I need to go pick up some sales. By the way, I just had one virgin come out in the uh, incubator, and this might be a good candidate for it too. But I still have like 10 more, 12 more to go in this yard. So I'm basically just getting a count of what I need on sales. Let's go. Let's see. Most of these should be nurse bees, and it's a rotten lead. I'm trying not to make noise. Something is stuck. The lid stuck, the inner cover. about y'all but if you've noticed I always like checking that inner cover see if there's any queen walking around it but I know <laughs> there's no queen in here or no mated queen all right this one right here was food This one had brood on it. It's got a sail right there. I just tore one up right there. It's got a sail on it right here. Going no farther. Yep, got a pretty sail right there. I am going no farther. So we good. I stay out of this one for about at least 14 more days. Because that queen's probably going to merge and in a couple days, maybe. Let me get some of this old propolis off here. Good to go. I know I got a sail over here. I know I got the queen here. So I'm gonna go ahead. That tells me there's a sail in here. When I got two bricks, I'll put one for that entrance and one for this entrance. If I know I got a queen here and I only got one brick, I'll put it over the back entrance for whatever that counts. If I know what's in there. So right now, we got a sail. Just in case you're wondering. That would tell me it's a mated queen. That would tell me I put a virgin queen in there. That tells me this is a sail. If you ever see it standing up, there may be several different reasons, but that tells me I gotta come back and look at it. Let me try to show y'all what I got here. I had split this colony. I couldn't find the queen. And uh, 
I split it with the double screen divider board, found the queen, I had her caged, <laughs> and somehow she got out. I guess my cage is bent, but she's over there. She was in the top box. So what I'm gonna do, uh, I'll find another place, I may go down there, or either up here, and uh, put her on a new bottom down that way. And I'm going, I may have to go back to the house and grab a box, but I'm going to be adding a box of that. I found sales in it, so I'll be adding a box to it because it's chugged full of nectar and bee bread. I hate y'all missed all that, but I was just running through the rest of the yard. Be right back. All right, brand new solid bottom is what I had on the truck. I'm going to go grab her that box and put it right here. Okay, I have got an empty box on the truck, but only one frame left, so I'm just going to... I don't want to mash it. Let's see. I'll show you what I'm going to do. Well, right now, until I get me another inner cover, I'm, I had bees coming in the back above the divider board coming in their entrance back here so I'm going to turn it upside down and all the field bees for that other box that had the queen in it can come back in this colony here this, this box will gain more field force and they uh, really need another box got to move Try to aim for the closing hole, like humans running for the elevator. All right, I'm going to grab a box and some comb and frames. Put back on here. Y'all need to get off of that too. I'm trying to get in. They know they belong there. They were already on. The I'm just gonna put this this way. Where the old field force to the queen. Lots will go right in here. Alright, y'all made it back. Smoker still a bit. I won't try to be, yeah, I'm gonna have to shake them up a little bit. I'll go ahead and put the box on and then I'll show you what I got for them. These come out of honey supers. They've been kind of beat around, banged around. Now, that one come out of a honey super, but I don't think it ever really had much of anything in it. Probably never was capped. It's a partial. This was a good one. That's an old one. It was probably right next to an old brood or something. And then some new plastic from Hill Coat. New frames. Now I'm going to go ahead and put this bottom on here. Let me see if I've got any cover. I'm going to 
put the notch toward the back. All the old field bees to the top box can come in. Just gotta make sure it's slid. The lid is slid all the way back. Okay, y'all, here's what we got. You saw this one. I showed it to you. I went through the whole yard with any split I made here. This is a nuke from another yard with sails in it. This one had a sail in it. See my brick? It's a nuke from another yard. This one I looked at last week. It ain't quite ready to split or anything. This one, I hadn't been in yet. Uh, I think I, what I did, I didn't, I couldn't find the queen and had sails. I don't know, but I got them standing up. I'm not going through it today. The more people mowing the mini storage is here. So I'm gonna go on through, just pass them by. Got a sail in this one above the board, queen in the bottom. Sail above the board, queen in the bottom. Sail above the board. Not sure what's in the bottom there, why I stood it up. Evidently I couldn't find the queen or whatever. Not going through it today. Uh, this one, I can't remember, I went through it, but there was, I think I had found sails in it, and couldn't find it. no sign of a queen, so I just closed it up. I won't go in it today. That wasn't a nuke. Y'all just watch me split that one. This one ain't quite ready to split. This one here, we got a sail above the board, queen in the bottom. Nuke from another yard. Sailing above the board, queen in the bottom. Nuke from another yard, nuke from another yard, nuke from another yard. And they all got sails. Sail above the board, queen in the bottom. All right, y'all, I'm gonna pack it up and go to the house. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. We'll see y'all on the next one.